guys, what's up? It's Becky. Welcome to my channel. And if you're new here, welcome. I'm so glad you're joining me today. So I know it's been a while since I've uploaded a video, but I was on a little vacation for the past two or three weeks and I'm finally back and I'm back with a hair coloring video. Thank God. I'm so glad I'm changing my hair color today. I literally, it's a huge ass mess. It's really, I would have never guessed I did purple before and people always ask me how I got my hair color as it is right now and I really don't know. Like chlorine, sun exposure, salt water and yeah that's all I can explain it as and I believe the blue undertones came from the purple having more blue undertones than purple so that's why my hair color is blue right now. Um, The green came from the chlorine so I can't explain that part besides it's chlorine but for my hair color today my vision is to do blue roots and then a green um like blue roots and then a green everywhere else so hopefully it works and today i'm using the guy tang my identity direct dye pastel hair colors in arctic blue and mints of steel so i'm crossing my fingers that it looks cute and that it actually comes out well. So yeah, if you are interested on how I got my hair color, just keep on watching. So for my vacation, I went to Maine to visit my sister because she goes to school there. And I also went to Maryland to go to the beach with my friends and yes i did wear a mask i self-quarantined myself and i took a test so if you're wondering if i put anyone at risk i did not i took all the precautions possible so first i'm just sectioning my hair off again like usual i'm going to just section off my hair into two little buns today and then i'm gonna go ahead and just maneuver through it while i do my hair So I just put my hair into two little buns like this and we're now going to go into my hair color. So the package says no developer required, direct dye neatly to do, direct dye neatly to clean dry hair and process for 20 minutes for increased vibrancy and animation use heat. Um, first I'm starting off with Arctic Blue. I'm just going to, I'm not mixing any colors together. I'm just going straight as is. So I'm just like poking it so it opens and this is Arctic Blue. It looks like this. Can you guys see it? This is the color it is right now. I'm just dropping it in here. So this is how the hair color looks. I don't know how it's going to turn out on my hair, but let's just go for it. Oh, wow. So this is how it looks, okay, it's not as dark as I expected it to be, actually.
all right so i just finished my roots um it actually was like harder than i expected i don't know why but it was like such a struggle and i did flip my glove so that the blue is on the other side this blue is completely dry it's like it stained it so yeah if you don't wear a glove i highly recommend you wear a glove because i like stained my um what is this called my arm a little bit if you guys can tell with blue i actually used the whole bottle of the blue there's not much in it to be honest i would say in my opinion i like squeeze it out all the way so i used one whole bottle for my roots this is how the green looks it's definitely like a royal green but i don't know let's find out this part definitely is going to be easier than doing my roots because the colors are way vibrant than I expected which I'm not mad about I'd rather have it more darker because it fades out slower you know so um, I'm not mad about that the box does say to wait 20 minutes for my hair to process it's been over 20 minutes obviously so I'm just gonna wait 30 minutes and then wash it out with shampoo and conditioner and then style it and I will be right back with how it finally looks all right so this is how my hair turned out how it looks i'm so happy the green is not a seaweed green thank god it's more of a mint green and the blue i'm not really sure how i feel about the blue honestly like i don't know if i wanted a different color a different shade or just more opaque in general there are splashiness going around on the blue areas if you guys can't tell um i'm not sure if i want to go back in and fix it or just leave it and let it fade out but Overall, I am so surprised how I look in the shade of green family. I really did not ever think that I would try out green or how I feel about green. Just because, you know, it's just green. No one really tends to do green hair. This hair color definitely pulls out my brown eyes. So my brown eyes family, whoever wants to, you know, change their hair color or is thinking about changing their hair color, I totally recommend you guys trying out blue or green. You will not be disappointed, trust me. I think next time I want to do my whole head blue. I'm not completely sure. Please let me know what you guys think and if you guys like the purple color or this color on me. Or if you want me to try any color in the color wheel spectrum, let me know. And I hope you guys enjoyed and thank you so much for joining me for my hair coloring process yet again. I really appreciate it. If you guys like this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, hit that notification bell so you're notified every time I post a new video. And if you guys want to follow me on my social media, I will be leaving all my links down below in the description box. Thank you so much for watching again. I will see you guys in the next one. Bye guys.